feel most welcome to this uh, video episode today is on 29th of october 2024 and we're focusing on the story of joe rogan joe rogan is uh, a popular american broadcaster popular american broadcaster so what he does he makes money from speaking he has a large following online. He has 17.5 million subscribers. That's on YouTube. So he makes money from YouTube ads. That is from the AdSense program. He has 14.5 million Spotify followers. 14.5 million Spotify followers. His podcast is known as Joy Rogan Experience. Joy Logan Experience is his podcast. Joy Logan Experience. So, uh, recently he came to the news. We heard more about him because of the interview that he conducted on Donald Trump. The Republican presidential candidate, Donald Trump, was interviewed by Joy Logan for three hours so imagine getting three hours of a presidential candidate he was even late for his next assignment why he was going to campaign so that he can speak to the followers to the subscribers of Choi logan you can imagine how powerful that Choi logan is so we are going to look at his uh, profile generally so we start with the uh, what trump said in that uh, interview on Choi rogan experience first he talked about many things you know in three hours you can you can talk about so many things but some of the things he discussed about uh, was about the people he has hired in the past his biggest mistakes and he said he has made mistakes for example he made a mistake hiring uh, some people uh, for example johnny kelly who was his chief of staff during his time time in the office uh, he also discussed about um, other people for example the former u.s national security advisor his name is john bolton he said that guy was an idiot i quote idiot in quotes uh, but he also mentioned that the guy was useful at times he could not miss to speak about alice uh, kamara harris the main competitor in the elections he said that lady has very low iq low iq in quotes that is quoted from him that was a very low iq person that's according to donald trump so back to the story main story who is joy logan joy logan was started his career as a comedian he is now a popular podcaster since 2009 to now 2024 he has been posting episodes on a regular basis. I think he posts every single day. Every single day. Apart from Sunday. So he posts Monday to Friday and sometimes Saturdays. He posts regularly. Consistency is the key here. He was born on August 11th, 1967 in a place called New Jersey. He is also a skilled martial artist a skilled martial artist so they call that a big and by a son of you joe logan is one of the most well-known podcasters around the world one of the most popular podcasters around the world his first job was as a cashier at a grocery store that was first job you know people have their first jobs even if now you are a ceo you are now the manager of a bank you are a credit officer in a bank. You are a teacher. You are a doctor. That was your first job. My first job was a teacher, a primary school teacher. I used to teach in an academy near my rural home. I was earning 2,500 shillings. And that was enough. By then, that was the year 2008. Earning 2,500 uh, was a lot of money for a village boy who had just completed his uh, uh, form for examinations 
So his first job was a cashier at a grocery store. Um, how much does he earn? He has so many sources of income. Uh, so the, we are told that if you want to succeed, don't depend on one source of income. You need several sources of income. For Joel Logan, his sources include sponsors of podcasts, from whom he makes over 300 million per annum. YouTube AdSense makes him five between five to seven million dollars per annum. UFC commentary two between two million to three million dollars per annum. He also makes money from comedy tours, something like $20 million per annum from comedy tours. He sells merchandise over $200 million in, in revenues or in sales, $200 million in sales from merchandise. Uh, so the key here is having various sources of income. Joe Rogan also made over $100 million from a deal with Spotify. A deal with Spotify. He made over a hundred million dollars. The other thing we learn from Joe Logan is consistency. He has been in the business of entertainment for over 35 years. Uh, since 1988, when he started as a comedian. Uh, Joe Logan has experience of over 14 years in broadcasting. That is since 2009. And since then, he has never missed releasing a podcast. From 2009 to 2024, which is now, he has never missed posting a podcast, high-quality podcast. He normally conducts interviews, and uh, he does not uh, focus on a specific topic. He has a variety of topics which he discusses, which now draws to him followers uh, or uh, subscribers. Joe Rogan is a lover, is a collector of cars. He has co a collection of cars, <clears throat> over 15 cars, which are worth over 20 million US dollars. They are sitting in his garage and he uses them, which includes a McLaren 720S. Uh, he owns a Tesla Model S, so he likes Teslas so much. Tesla Model S B100D. He owns 208, 2008 Shark Wax Porsche 977. He owns a 993 Ganta Wax Porsche 911. He owns a 1993 Porsche 964. He owns a 2021 Ford Laptar. He owns a 1971 Ford Bronco Icon 4x4. He owns a 1995 Toyota Land Cruiser F2J80. He also owns a 1965 Cofete Stingley. He owns a 1969 Chevrolet Nora. A 1970 Braymouth Barracuda, among other cars. He also owns over 15 homes, which are scattered across the United States of America. That is the story of Joy Rogan. He is said to have a net worth of over 100 million US dollars. It is not very clear. You know, sometimes these things is to just approximate. You can never tell how rich a person is. But he's very rich when we compare him to other comedians and podcasters around the world. Thank you very much for tuning in to Karosi TV. If you are new here, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and make sure you feel at home. Like comment and share with your networks. Thank you. See you in the next episode.